Hi everyone, this is Chetan Parashar on the channel The Optimum Cube. Today I'll be talking about something which I come across very often. A lot of people do come to me and ask me about this particular thing. They ask me about the tips and tricks to increase their confidence. Because confidence is needed in both your personal as well as your professional life. I'll be talking about few tips and tricks which you can use in your daily routine so as to increase your confidence. You may start with one or two tips initially and gradually move to as many tips you can follow in your daily routine so as to improve and take your confidence to the level you want, always want to take it to. So let's get going now. Avoid negative people and negative energies. They are the one who will always discourage you. They will never let your confidence grow. Instead, in case you want to increase your confidence, what you can do is start spending time with like-minded people, people who encourage you and get into activities which give you positive vibes and positive energies. This will actually help you boost your confidence. Learn as much as possible. Make your brain work as much as possible. Read the relevant things. Feed your brain. Make yourself knowledgeable. Keep yourself updated. Somebody who is updated is always confident about what is happening in and around. In case you are not, nobody likes to interact with somebody who is having stale information. So to be confident, keep yourself updated. Learn to overcome your failures. There is nobody in this world who has succeeded without failures. Every successful person has to surpass a lot of failures. You are no exception. Making mistakes is no problem. Don't be afraid of it. Make mistakes if need be. The important thing is to try and get into that. So don't be afraid of making mistakes. You cannot be perfect and take time. Change your negative ideas into positive ones. Negative is I can't do this. Positive is I can do this. When you are not confident, you always fall in this particular category where you say you can't do this. You cannot transform, you cannot move from here to here in one go. The best thing to do is find a neutral one, which is let me try. Before you say I can't do this, you just say let me try it once. So from negative to positive, the step in between is let me try. This will give you that boost you always wanted to have. So this will move you from negative to neutral and then to the positive one. So start working on this, this will actually help you increase your confidence. Appreciate and compliment people. This is an amazing trick to work upon. This will make other people feel good about you. Exchange of positive vibes automatically happens as in when you appreciate people and you give them a compliment. People start feeling good about you, giving you your confidence the boost that you always wanted to have. So start working on this. This is an amazing trick to work upon. Identify things you are very good at. I'll give you an example here. There are two situations. Situation A, in which you are very comfortable, you are very confident about it. And situation B, where you know you are not very confident about it. While working in situation B, what you can do is, think a bit about situation A. It will give you that positive energy if you can tackle situation A well, why can't you tackle situation B as good as that? So you will be able to tackle the situation positively. You will be able to give you that boost that you always wanted to have. Take pride in what you are doing. Think good about situation A. It will help you tackling situation B equally good. I will talk about one of the most important things now. And that thing is one of the biggest confidence killers. And that is Comparison. Stop comparing yourself with others. You might be good at a particular thing, the other might be good at another. You cannot be same, you cannot be like others. You have to be on your own. It's extremely important for one to understand that you have your own set of strengths and weaknesses. So don't compare yourself with others all the time. That will never let your confidence grow. Helping others is not something which people feel very great about. But let me be very frank with you, as in when you help somebody, you start feeling proud about yourself. And when you feel proud about yourself, you start feeling confident about yourself. So it's extremely important that you should try and help as much as possible because it will give your confidence that boost that you always wanted. A few tips to increase your external confidence now. First of all, you need to take care of your body. It's extremely important to stay fit. 
Do some extra exercise, nourish your body well, keep yourself aligned and in shape. It's extremely important. If you feel fit from within, you start feeling confident about yourself automatically. The next thing that you need to have in mind is the grooming part. Groom yourself well. It's extremely important to feel good about yourself as in when you're going out. That is what is important. When you're well groomed, you're automatically confident. Last but not the least, you should always try to dress up well. Dressing up well will always give you that extra edge that you always wanted to give your confidence a boost. Last thing which I would like to share with you people now. It's extremely important for us to understand that confidence is not built in one day. It takes a lot of time. You need to practice a lot. What I would like to recommend here is that you try and incorporate these tips and tricks as a part of your daily routine. The more you practice on these particular things, the more confident you will become and you'll be able to enhance your confidence. I'm very sure that the tips which I've shared with you today will be of some use in increasing your confidence. Do like this video and subscribe to this channel. I'll be coming up with more videos which will be of great help in your personal as well as your professional life. Wishing you all the best. Thank you.